Hey folks, it's Leboy56 coming back at you with the Mortal Phoenix Rising. Today, or whenever you're watching this, we're going to be tackling yet another liar challenge. Myth, myth challenge relates to the uh, small liar. Let's see. It's at this part of the map. The other liar challenge was over here. So, let's get to it. You know, you know the drill now. We have to light up all four of these crystals by pressing buttons related to the crystals. This is one of them, by the way. This is the first one. Ha! Press it. Next up, the second one, the second, uh, second button. Second button's behind this red gate. Kind of like the gates in, um, Star Wars. Those red gates in the Phantom Menace? Yeah, that's what these are, basically. Alright. So, this stone is, like, kind of, kind of strategically placed here for a reason. It was, just, it was already there, but let's see. This statue is pointing at something. Kind of, not pointing, but if you look up, and he's not, you know, he just kind of strategically aimed, strategically placed, and let you know where the button is. Grab the stone from down there with L1 triangle. And then this is actually broken here already beforehand. And the, I mean, this was not broken beforehand. This, uh, the diamonds over there. These diamonds were never here in the first place. I broke the wall that was right there. And then it had cracks in it, etc. So I'm not going to break it again. I need this stone for later. Um, anyways, take your bow and arrow. Shoot this. I, mean, I haven't, again, I haven't fully completed this puzzle yet. I'm just doing it for you during the middle of the puzzle so you guys have a better idea of what, what all activates each other. That's the second button that I have not pressed yet. This third button, I actually have pressed, but I, I kind of did these out of order, so don't worry about that fact, I'm doing them out of order. It doesn't really matter, there's no real order to them. So, they are all individual puzzles. I'm just doing this for the sake of this video being a bit shorter. So I'm running around everywhere across this uh, temple, I'm, I'm going to get out of It's going to take a bit longer. Alright. Button for door, kind of, not really for this door. That gate. Uh, triangle, drop it like it's hot. Don't worry about this button, it's just to uh, escape in case you happen to do this. If you actually do that, you won't be able to escape this place really, so... Not not easily at least. Naturally, you just press this button and leave if you want to. That's what that's for. That's so you just don't get soft stuck in the game by basically locking yourself into a certain area. Let's dive down, circle. And this will lead us to the third button. This underwater passage. Here we go. Like I said earlier, I've already pressed this one. This one not only opens the, uh, the main door eventually, it also opens up this gate. That gate right there. Alright. Uh, I'll just walk around, never mind. Not gonna climb. Time to run! I'm saving the best one for last. I've done this one too, but this one's quite a bit more confusing. Take note of this torch. That's ar it's already lit, but it was not lit prior to this video. Go inside this cave next to the torch. You can kind of still see it there. Drop down. So you see the button? This box. It was actually originally right about the box. Oh, come on. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna forget about it. Anyways, the box is behind the wall right here. It was kind of hidden. So you grab the box, the magnetism through the wall, and drop it, that activates the torch over here. This lets you shoot the torch with fire. This is pretty badass, so take take note of this. This you might have to, you might have to do this later in the game, so draw your bow. Shoot with R1. You wanted to guide the arrow here. You definitely need to guide the arrow, I'm pretty sure. The arrow catches on fire. I missed it, whoops. My bad. I'm not the, I'm not the best accuracy as Hanzo, don't worry. 
I'm pretty bad at Hanzo. Okay. The torch is now lit. And if you're confused about what I just said, that was just a reference to Overwatch. Uh, I'm gonna stop with the weird references now. Come in here. And press the button. Let's go get that liar. Wait. Oh. That is an enemy, that's weird. Oh. Actually, to defeat the enemy. Yeah, I defeated your henchman, now I can kill you. The liar, the small liar. And that was 31244. Let's, let's play again, make sure. 31244, guys. And that's the end of the small liar video. Hopefully, it helped you guys figure out how to get to that and play it. Remember the strings. The strings are very important. I'll have them written down in the description of the video again to let you know. Have a good one, guys. Thanks for watching.